Ladies and gentlemen, I want to welcome you back to the Tid Little Taste Tour. Welcome back. I'm feeling a little creepy taste. right now. Feeling creepy? And with that, <laughs> okay. So in the nice fall tradition, Halloween brew. in the fall Ooh. tradition, we're gonna have something Ooh. special. Southern Tier Brewing Company presents the Blackwater Series Warlock. Imperial Stout brewed with pumpkins and natural flavor. Oh shit. 8.6% alcohol by volume. Mm -hmm. 42 degrees Fahrenheit is the uh, suggested temperature to serve it at. Now how many, um, how many chambers do you get with this at level 50? They change Warlock it. Warlock is brewed they to enchant your palate on its own and also to counterpoint our Imperial Ale Pump King. Make your own black magic by carefully pouring this Imperial Stout into a goblet. Dark and Mysterious, the Blackwater series, is serious about high gravity. Reanimate your senses with Warlock's huge roasted malt character, moderate carbonation, and spicy pumpkin pie aroma. Brewed and bottled by Southern Tier Brewing Company, Lakewood, New York, USA. Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, Warlock. Nice. I like, uh, I like the graphics. But yeah, the, the new Warlocks are really, really awful. Not this, but we're talking about something else. Awful. And we're not talking about wow either. We're talking, about, shut up. we're talking about Eric. He's fucking dark and mysterious. He is bad. I can, well, I can get down with that. This doesn't look as dark as I expect. I guess it's not. What does it say? Imperial stout? I don't know, but it smells amazing. Is it imperial? Ooh, smell that. Now, yeah. now let's transport. We're, it should be darker night. for an imperial. It's Halloween, Halloween night. night. You're out in the in the, it's crisp night. Yeah. It's clear. The ghouls are out. Every yeah, you're, just, you're going and to have ghouls. fun. Yeah. Let's the see ghosts. what this will taste like on Halloween night. Ghosts. Oh yeah. Yeah. It does smell pretty. Good. It smells like a southern tier. By George, I think they got it. That is amazing. Oh yeah. They they nailed it. They nailed it. Oh. Pumpkiny. So here's the deal, really. It's very similar to pumpkin. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's, it's got that pumpkin flavor. Yeah, it's but very it's a similar to pumpkin, but it's a stout. I it's less sweet. currently honestly prefer it. I, I prefer like it too. better. So than here's the deal. It's got it's got a little less, bit of a crisp, it's less, bitter bite, so you can drink a lot. It's of it. less sweet. Yeah. Pumpkin is way too sweet and way too rich. This, yep. this is less sweet. Yeah. It's more um, robust. Not necessarily in the amount of flavor, they both have a ton of flavor, but it's more robust in the sense of it has more, uh, I guess, I, I don't know how to describe it other than definition. Like when it, yeah. as soon, okay, don't laugh here guys. As soon as it enters your mouth, <laughs> there it is, enters the as, soon, enters your mouth. as soon as it does, there's, there's, Im <laughs> stop it. Okay. Immediately, <laughs> it's, it's pumpkin pie. And, <laughs> That's not a bad thing. <laughs> I wish mine was pumpkin pie. I mean, I if I if I say that to a girl in the bar, that I think it goes here I'm immediately into pumpkin <laughs> pie. <laughs> uh, I'd be taking home every chunky chick in the world. I'm True. Yeah. No. Point is, it's really good. A lot of pumpkin pie, a lot of that nutmeggy. It it does taste very similar to pumpkin, yeah. but less sweet, less rich, and more hearty. I would say it's good. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. Mm. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, it's really good. I, I, I could take even a little bit more of the Imperial Stout flavor. Yeah, because there's not, there's not a lot of like the dark roasted malt no. and the chocolatey stuff. They should have just um, called it a, a pumpkin stout or something. But it's not much Imperial. 8.6 makes it pretty Imperial. It's most pretty heavy. Imperial Stouts I go for are like 11, 12 range. You gotta figure, most but stouts, stouts are between 4 and 5 percent. Stouts are low, low actually or low, or usually like around 4 yeah. percent. Yeah, but I still I like my Imperials around 11. I think at 8.6 you can call it an Imperial. Oh yeah, you okay. can, you can. Yeah. It's just not, it's not as dark as I would have hoped. But I like the really dark. But I think, dark I think if they went that direction, it, the, the complaints would be yes. most people would complain about. Well, it's just it's not it's it's like a right. Yeah, right. right. Because that's that's right. not the so point. So then, of this where's movie. where's the yeah. pumpkin thing? I agree. That's not the point of this. Beer. No, they probably hit a good um, balance. Mm. I think my rating on this. I is definitely. I think my rating on this is going to be a nine point zero. I think it's yeah. delicious. I think they, I think they're knocking out of the park with this stuff, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm giving this a nine. It's really, really good. Check it out. If, if you think that sounds good at all to you, you will like it. Eight, eight, five. It's pretty good. So much pumpkin pie. And actually, one thing they say here, so they give um, a description of the beer. So they say, it says color, black. 
body full of bitter medium. Well, it's not um, black like an actual imperial stout, but it's but it's dark. It, it looks it's like so. Ale. The thing that I was specifically yeah, like a ale. the thing that I was specifically intrigued with, which it, the last taste of it when I as soon as I saw this was like yes, definitely pair with. Okay, so it's a spicy barbecue roasted smoked foods. The last one, carrot cake. It has a bit of a carrot cakey taste. All, if the, you, all of the pumpkin Southern Cheer stuff. Has yeah, a they cake. do. If you have like. There's that little bit of that really rich mm. carrot cakey thing going on it. Sure, sure. Yes. Um, but I think I mean the, no, definitely. Yeah. The you're right. the, the pump the, the series the Southern Tier series of the Blackwater series is all pretty much delicious and um, in this situation uh, again the description would basically be pumpkin with a little less sweetness and richness and a little more malty. Um, it's a good mid level parties. imperial stout mixed with pumpkin. Yeah. It's very good. Uh, not uh, so we got. In, Else it's add? got a cool name. Would you like to add anything else to Warlock here? I very like, good. I like very the jacket good. Good. with the with the purple wizard hat on the front. Great the art. Which like you will that. be seeing right back here. Yeah, hopefully if we can make that happen. Well, hopefully we will. No, we see. I see it. I see it. Oh, are you, oh, gonna, yeah. are you gonna are you gonna put a big a big logo back there, or are you gonna individually put wizard hats on all of us? No, not gonna do. You don't that. have that much skill. We can do that. I can. We do can do I, that. If I watch this video and I don't right now have a goddamn purple wizard hat above my head, and there I'm, it is. I'm pissed. There it is. The taste tour is over. Thank see you it. for joining us. It's a nine point zero, a nine point zero, and an eight point five. If you have any interest at all in uh, the description of this, check out the Southern Tier Blackwater series Warlock Imperial Stout with pumpkin flavors and spices. We will return. Thanks for joining us. Keep clicking. Don't go.